Hey everyone, it's James George with Web Design Blog, and this week I'm going to talk about Hootsuite and uh, some tips for using Hootsuite with multiple Twitter accounts. If you've been following me for a while, you know that I own multiple design blogs. I own uh, creativebeacon.com, that's my flagship site that's been around for a couple of years. And I also own uh, webdesignblog.org, which used to be .co, but now it's all .org. Um, design crawl which is a rapidly growing uh, design site and I just started web design fanatic a little while ago so I have all these sites and uh, I have Twitter accounts that represent all of these sites so sometimes what you'll want to do is you'll want to follow multiple you'll want to follow the same people on multiple accounts just because you know you might re retweet or share something that they uh, have said, or you might want to follow your own Twitter accounts and retweet other, you know, share stuff across the entire network. Uh, it's a common uh, practice with uh, a network of sites. So I'm just going to pick a, a typical account. Let's say that you're scrolling down through here, and um, let's see, I'm just going to pick, uh, okay, Design Milk. Um, if it if you want to see your relationship with any of the people that are in your feed, like I'm already following them with uh, Create a Beacon, that's why they're in my feed. If you click Design Milk, it'll pop up and you have this whole window here that shows you uh, your relationship with Design Milk. And uh, this is really handy because when you scroll down, this is the part that, that I want to show you is when you look at relationships, you see their Twitter account, you see their website, you see their bio, everything, their followers, uh, clout score, all that stuff. But one thing that you see is that they're not following me. But you also see that, okay, Design Crawl is following them, but nobody, nobody else says, well, okay, Web Design Blog and G Squared Studios. Um, you can see who of your accounts are not following other people, and you can instantly add them in like two seconds here. Boom, boom, boom. You can follow the same account through all of your social media accounts in, at one, in one shot. That's pretty, uh, that's pretty awesome and really handy. Another thing is you can see uh, their timeline. You can see their list of tweets. So you don't have to go into Twitter to do anything. Everything is available right here inside of Hootsuite, and that's why it's so val valuable. I've been using Hootsuite for a while, and I could not live without it. I would I would not eat lunch for a day or two to pay for my subscription if I got title money because I use it so much I'd have to. But that's that's not a problem. But I'm just saying that I could not live without Hootsuite. You'll also see uh, any mentions of uh, the Twitter account that you're looking at, and any favorites, and you can go through and you can reply to anything especially like on their timeline, you can reply, you can retweet, you can direct message them, uh, you can favorite, you can email it to somebody. Uh, it's just everything, you have access to everything right here inside of this little panel. And a lot of people don't realize when they're using Hootsuite that that's that you can do this. And um, you know, you wouldn't think you would think it would take you to their Twitter page or take you away from here, but it doesn't. You have all the access right inside this little panel. Well, that's my little tip for this week. I'm James George, and this is Web Design Blog.